Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another video. Today's song is on Very A Friend and it's on the ukulele. So let's get started. This is the structure for this song. Uh, to get you playing this song quicker, I want to note that the refrain, chorus, and bridge are the same. The intro, verse 1, and verse 2 are the same, just different in length, and the post-chorus is kind of on its own. So starting off with the chords, the chords you're going to be using are G minor, and then a C minor, then a D7. Alright, so there are two strum patterns that you can use for this entire song. Uh, the first one is down up. And the other one is just a down strum. So I guess it depends on what strum pattern you want to choose. So the intro is the foundation of the verses and it's two lines of G minor. For each line of G minor, it's going to be an eight count. So what you're doing is if you're doing the down strums, it's going to be eight down strums. If you're doing the down up strums, just count eight as you're doing it. So right now I'll be doing the example of the intro and also counting it out as we are strumming it. So that was two lines of the intro. Now the verse one is going to be four lines of that. And then verse two is going to be double that. So it's going to be eight lines of that. So now going into the refrain, chorus, and bridge, we're going to be using all three chords. So we're going to be using the G minor, C minor, and then the D7, and then back to G minor. And we're gonna be playing this two times. So for each chord is gonna be played for four counts now. So I'll show you guys an example and also count it out. So I'm gonna have the refrain on the screen with the lyrics so that you guys can play and sing with it. So lastly is the post chorus. It's just like verse one. You're going to be playing four lines of G minor, but the first two lines are just going to be one down strum of eight counts. So you hear the bass come in, and that's where the post chorus comes. So here's an example of it. So now you guys got everything from the chords and the strumming to play this song. I'm going to have in the comments or the description the structure, the lyrics, and the chords on there so you guys can play it with the actual song. So thanks again guys for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And uh, give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys on the next one.